everyone. Happy Friday. We're down here at Hendrickson Lake again. We're hanging out with the geese and the swans. And there was a couple ducks over there. Yep, a couple ducks over here too. And there's a lot here today. They're all here chilling. Sun is sneaking up behind the houses over there. Sky's turning really pretty. And it's Friday. It's Friday. And let's just thank God it's Friday. You know, I like to say thank God it's every day. Every day is a gift. So every day is a gift. We shouldn't say thank God it's Friday. We should thank God it's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Every day is a gift. So, and we got to make every day count. So we need a message of the day. What should we talk about today? We'll talk about yesterday. I got invited to a lunch in Manhattan uh, with a couple of uh, uh, old friends from the industry. Uh, from the HVAC industry, and uh, it was kind of nice because um, we kind of forget we used to have meetups all the time of, uh, you know, fundraisers and stuff in the city for all the contract associations and lunches and all this kind of, I don't know, uh, charity work and, and associations and stuff like that, and we would all get together for lunch and pre-pandemic, and um, some are competitors, some are customers. Uh, some are similar trades, uh, just a bunch of uh, business owners, and we all kind of got together and uh, and got to chat a little bit. And it's been a while with COVID, you kind of forget how that stuff used to happen. We were talking about, um, at one point, there was like a different charity function every night of the week uh, before COVID. Um, it almost was getting to be too much. Um, and now it went from, you know, to nothing. So I actually wonder how some of the charities are surviving. I'm sure they're hurting. But... Um, yeah, we kind of missed the interaction of everyone telling the stories, the war stories of uh, this one and that one. And remember this guy, remember this company, remember this job. Uh, it was really kind of cool to, to reconnect with everybody. Um, and um, one of the guys there is a friend of mine. Um, great guy. Super, super talented. Um, he's self-made millionaire. Multi, multi, multi millionaire. He was someone that started in the industry. Uh, as a as a worker, and worked his way from the ladder to the CEO, and uh, recently sold this company for lots and lots of millions, and it kind of just shows you what is possible if you just do the work, if you just get your head in the game, um, and you build the relationships. We talked a lot about yesterday about relationships. Um, in order to be successful, you need to surround yourself with people who are successful. And you need to make relationships with people that uh, you can do business with. Uh, intentionally, you know, go to the fundraisers, support each other's charities, um, go to lunches with people, um, check in with them, have dinner with people, um, people in your industry, customers, clients. Uh, be intentional and go out of your way and build the relationships. And as you build those relationships in your life, the business comes through it because, um, most times, like we sell, you know, we do air conditioning, we do real estate. Um, most times in life, there's a million people that do air conditioning, there's a million people that sell real estate, but people deal with people they know, love, and trust, people that they like to be around, people that they know they can count on, people that they know are reliable. Um, so you need to establish that with people in your life. You need to build those relationships. You need to build um, confidence and, and, and trust amongst uh, customers and clients and friends. And that's when um, they're gonna refer you business. That's when they're gonna wanna work with you. And that's when you get to do life together and you get to win together, you get to help each other. Um, a lot of people keep their head down and uh, don't really look around. Don't really reach out and check on people. Don't say good morning, don't say hello. Um, don't hold the door for people. Uh, all these things in life are building relationships are building character and you need to be intentional with this stuff you can't just exist you can't just go through life thinking about yourself um, you need to reach out and touch other people in your life uh, i say it a lot um i try to do it myself um reach out and check on people ask them if they're okay uh my buddy benny benny montabano his birthday the other day uh he sends me memes all the time silly face and with a with a heading that says you good with a question mark. And uh, you know what? It really lights your day up. You could be in a funk and you get the silly picture of him that says you're good with a question mark. 
And even if I wasn't good, I'm good because I know someone checked on me. So go out of your way and just check on people. Go out of your way and make arrangements to have lunch with someone. Go out of your way to make arrangements to have dinner with someone. Go out of your way to make arrangements to have breakfast with someone. Um, go out of your way to um, say hello to people along your journey. Go out of your way to uh, hold the door for people. Go out, of the, go out of your way to do whatever you can to make other people's lives better. Um, it's really important um, to, to get outside of ourselves, to give um, the power of good morning. I ride my bike here every morning, and every time uh, I could pass a group of people, um, not in this park, but a lot of different parks, I switch it up every morning. Um, I say good morning to everybody. Like, I make myself get out of my shell and say good morning. And when I do that, they light up. Um, and now, because there were 186 days in on this journey, as people see me in the park, they see me come, I see their face light up, and I see them start smiling, and I see them rush to say good morning to me. And it's so cool. It's so cool. Uh, that little good morning, that little, hey, someone cares about me, uh, really, really um, can change someone's uh, morning, can change someone's day. Um, you know, holding the door for someone, you know, letting uh, someone's trying to merge into traffic, don't fight them, wave them in. Someone's trying to pull out of a driveway into, into traffic, wave them in, slow down, let them in. Why do we give everyone such a hard time? Um, just help people, just just be intentional. Um, again, just, just go out of your way to connect with people. Go out of your way to um, just really make sure people in your life are all right and make sure um, there's no way that, um, that they're okay and there's maybe any way that you can help them because um, the more people you help in a life, the more connections you make, the more relationships you make, one, it feels good, and two, it's going to make you more successful. Um, when it is what you do, whatever it is, uh, and you have people that know, love, and trust you, uh, when it comes time to sell real estate, when it comes time to do air conditioning, when it comes time to do plumbing, when it comes time to do marketing, when it comes time to uh, do finance, whatever it is that you do, uh, when people know, love, and trust you, they're going to come to you, and you're going to build your business. So it's twofold. So you get to feel good. You get to help people, make them feel good. And you get to build your business at the same time. It's so important. It's so important. So many people I know that that are in sales, that are in business, that, are, that you know, doing their marketing for their businesses, they don't help people. They don't reach out and touch people. They don't check on people. They don't go to lunch with you know new clients. You know, reach out, pick up the phone, and go to lunch with someone. Hey, what are you doing Friday? Let's grab lunch today. Let's find out what you're about. Let's see how I can help you. Maybe you can help me. We can build a relationship together. And we can help each other win at life and live life together. But it's all about being intentional with the relationships in your life. So there's your message of the day. Sun is still not up. It's still coming up. The geese are making a racket. We got a lot of them here today. Look at all the geese over here. There was a swan. Oh, the swan, oh two swans over there sleeping. There are regulars. They're here every day. And there's a couple of ducks mixed, mixed in here. But uh, all right. So let's jump on prayers. Chilly this morning. It's like 40 degrees. Uh, all right, in the name of Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for our sinners, now at the hour of our death, Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to uh, go out of our way and get out of our comfort zone and build the relationships with people in our lives. Um, help us to not think of ourselves first and help us to think of others first. Help us to um, try and put smiles on all the people's faces and help them out and help them live life better. Um, we got to make a conscious effort to get out of our own heads and, and reach out to others in our lives and try and make their lives better. Um, and in that process, you get to build, uh, build relationships and build, uh, build your business and build your client base um, because people like to work with people that they like. And uh, it's a win all around. It's a win all around. Making friends, uh, increasing your business, helping people. Win, win, win. All we do is win. So there's your message. Uh, there's your message of the day. Um, it's chilly. Woo. Wind picked up. Right, the geese are out here. The sun is coming up. It's Friday. And uh, we got a weekend coming up. Um, we got our new listing up, 120 Hanson. Uh, I got to swing by there. Hopefully it's ready. The contractor was supposed to clean it. Uh, we will check on that. I'll let you know for sure. 
and we're going to start showing that one as soon as it's clean. And uh, that's a nice four bedroom, center hall colonial, two baths, uh, about 2,000 square feet on a 76 by 100 property, 779 in the heart of Mount Vernon, all redone, new bathrooms, new kitchen, uh, hardwood floors, everything's done. So um, that's coming up. I'll let you know. You'll see on here my wall when that's ready to go. We'll get you in there. All right, everyone, have a great day. Appreciate you all. Put your head in the pillow every night knowing you made the world a better place. Fire starts fire. Let's go.